Good evening, YouTubers. I hope you're all having a great evening. RV Deb's here with you on Monday. It's about 10 minutes before 11 p.m., so I thought I would get a video out and try to just put something together t this evening since I hadn't done any videoing today. Um, mostly today, in the early part of the day, I painted. I, I gotta show you what I'm painting. Uh, I, I get asked to paint different things. Some of the things that I get asked, I don't feel like I could paint. Someone asked me to paint Jesus. I can't paint Jesus. Somebody asked me to paint fruit. I, I just, that just doesn't, at this point today anyway, no, I didn't feel like paying, paying, painting fruit. Sorry. But someone asked me by the name of Heather, a really nice person, uh, if I could do a fairy. So I thought, oh, okay, let me try a fairy. This is a little tiny one, a five by seven. This is about at half done. It's not, I'm going to show you it now and then when it's done, I'll show it to you too. And this is my little fairy. She will be getting better and better. She's just got her shape now, but her wings need work and uh, her hands. She hasn't got any hands. And that's her. Yeah, her hair and everything needs, you know, it, it's layered and takes time. And look, isn't this the cutest little easel? I love my new little easel. That's This easel was given to me by Patrick from the Paddy Wagon, along with some oil paints and some big canvas. There's two right there. They're big. So, but anyway, yeah, I love this little stand. It just works out so well. And you can, you know, you can make it big. I'm digging it. And I also, after t uh, tonight, I made dinner. Um, I made some linguine and clam sauce. And Patrick from the Paddy Wagon came over and had dinner with me. And that's the first time I've had dinner inside for a, a long time. It's been since I had somebody over. It gets crowded in here. I had to move all my paintings and stuff. Um, but it turned out really good, and he enjoyed it. And I enjoyed his company. He's such a nice guy. If you haven't subscribed to the Paddy Wagon, definitely, you know, his channel's growing. He's he's very good. He has a lot of good content, and he's a good guy. And new to, new to RVing, too, and he's full-time now, along with me. And there's several people. Actually, um, another person messaged me, and they're coming to the Hilltop RV Park soon, too. I uh, It's amazing. I'm going to fill this place up with friends. So that's really nice. It's a great little spot, you know. I mean, there, there's the things that it doesn't have. It doesn't have a pool. It'd be hard to be here in the summer, you know, without being able to swim and get cool. But uh, otherwise, it's got everything you need. It's peace and quiet, beautiful trees, lots of lawns. It's it's clean, and the people are friendly enough, and just it's nice. I like it here. Um, the clubhouse is more like a guy's man cave. I've said that before. But that doesn't affect me one way or the other. So, um, but I enjoy the place, and I like my neighbor tonight. Um, I have a, a really good friend that lives a couple doors down who doesn't want to be part of YouTube, but I don't blame him. That's his prerogative. But anyway, he invited me and got to meet Patrick tonight, and we had dessert at his place. So, we had pecan pie and cuit. And that is so good. So that was nice. So it was a good dinner. It was great afterwards, you know, going to uh, my neighbor's because he's got a big, a big place, a nice big fifth wheel. Those are really comfortable. I think if I was really going to stay in a park uh, for a long time, that would be what I would want to get because they're very roomy. And this isn't bad. It's, it's just, I fill it with a lot of stuff. So, you know, painting and, and just all my stuff and dogs but um, it's been a good day tomorrow is going to be a bad storm it's supposed to start about 3 p.m. and it's gonna supposedly be over by midnight it's supposed to be really bad winds and possible tornadoes now that's happened here a lot lately but they said on the news that 
that they have this category one through five when it comes to, I guess, tornado and wind and bad storms, and this is a four. And they said they hadn't had a four here in a long time. So that's kind of freaky. Yeah, so around 3 p.m., you know, we'll see. Poor Rosie, she's going to just totally flip out. As it is, she's sitting next to me because it started raining uh, earlier tonight, and uh, that just gets her. So we'll have to hold on for dear life. I'll, I'm sure I'll do some videos of it. That's what I'll probably wind up doing. Just wish me luck. Wish us all luck and pray that this storm passes over and doesn't hurt anything here at the hilltop because we're all living in our homes and it's important. And plus, I don't even know where I'd go. You know, I mean, if if we have a tornado warning, which means take cover, I would probably I would probably go to the clubhouse, drive over to the clubhouse, and with the dogs. They better let me in with the dogs. That's what I have to say. So, either that or the bathrooms. And uh, that would be it. Just uh, wish for the best, right? I don't know. I've never been in a tornado, and I never want to be in one. But there has been a lot of tornado damage just above this area. It's not This area is not known for the, getting the tornadoes. It's the, I guess, north of here, or... East of here? I think east of here. Okay, so that's the story for today. <laughs> Hope you all had a nice day. I had. And we'll talk tomorrow. Be well. Be happy. Just take each day as a gift, because it is. And um, peace out, my friends. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do. Give me a thumbs up if you feel like appreciate that too. Take care. Bye.